Honorable members, it is my great pleasure and honor to indicate to this house that the whole Pradhan Mantri Chaudhary Charan Singh Ji has been given to the Bhaar Tratan. भारत के प्रधानमंत्री नरेंद्र मोदी जी ने अपने ट्वीट में ये कहा है कि यह सम्मान देश के लिए उनके अतुलनीय योगदान को समर्पित है उन्होंने किसानों के अधिकार और उनके कल्याण के लिए अपना पूरा जीवन समर्पित कर दिया था उत्तर प्रदेश के मुख्यमंत्री रहे या देश के गृह मंत्री विधायक के रूप में उन्होंने हमेशा राष्ट्र निर्माण को गति प्रदान की है वे आपातकाल के विरोध में भी डटकर खड़े रहे हमारे किसान भाई बहनों के लिए उनका समर्पण भाव और इमरजेंसी के दौरान लोकतंत्र के लिए उनकी प्रतिबद्धता पूरे देश को प्रेरित करने वाली है मेरे लिए यह परम सौभाग्य है कि मुझे आपके समक्ष एक ऐसे व्यक्तित्व है जो ईमानदारी के प्रतीक रहे हैं किसान के लिए समर्पित रहे हैं उनको भारत रत्न देने की सूचना दे रहा हूं Honorable members, it is a matter of immense joy that the Government of India is conferring Bharat Ratan on Dr. M. S. Swami Nathanji. The Honorable Prime Minister has tweeted, it is in recognition of his monumental contributions to our nation in agriculture and farmers' welfare. He played a pivotal role in helping India achieve self-reliance in agriculture during challenging times and made outstanding efforts towards modernizing Indian agriculture. I had the good occasion to interact with him when I first made an entry into the parliament. And I am sure everyone associated with agriculture and farming will be delighted. It is a day of great satisfaction for every farmer, every person in this country that Chaudhary Charan Singh Ji and Swami Nathan Ji have been accorded Bharat Ratan. Honorable members, another distinguished son of the nation, former Prime Minister, Sri P.V. Narsimha Rao Garu has been honored with Bharat Ratan. 
Sri Narasimha Rao has been known, and the Prime Minister has rightly noticed it, a distinguished scholar and statesman. I had many occasions to personally interact with him while he was Prime Minister. During his tenure, there were issues on which he sought my legal advice and suggestions. Every time I came away enlightened, his approach was sagacious and full of sublimity. Honorable Prime Minister has indicated that Narsimha Ravji Garu is equally remembered for the work he did as Chief Minister of Andhra Pradesh, Union Minister, and as Member of Parliament and Legislative Assembly for many years. His visionary leadership was instrumental in making India economically advanced, laying a solid foundation for the country's prosperity and growth. Narsimha Rao Garu's tenure as Prime Minister was marked by significant measures that opened India to global markets, fostering a new era of economic development. His contributions to India's foreign policy, language and education sectors underscore his multifaceted legacy as a leader who not only steered India through critical transformations, but also unrest its cultural and intellectual heritage. I am sure it, all these three awardees, it's a matter of satisfaction for every Indian.